One of the most difficult questions in uh, aesthetic surgery of the facial skeleton is to decide where to actually put the bones in the sagittal dimension, in the anterior posterior dimension, where to bring the maxilla, where to bring the mandible. Now, eight years ago, we defined and published an original plane or reference that we call soft tissue plane, which is a plane that goes to the root of the nose, what we call the nation, and goes perpendicular to the floor. So when I try to decide where to put the bones, this is an absolute reference for me. I need that the upper incisor, meaning the upper jaw, the maxilla, goes forward to touch this line or be in front of this line. And of course the mandible has to accompany that and at the end the chin also is in front of this line. So again, this is an absolute reference for me when I am doing my aesthetic surgical planning. So when I do this planning, I need to transfer all this information into our 3D planning through the original 3D platform that we designed 10 years ago and published in the International Journal. So all these concepts of forward reposition in the facial skeleton have to be incorporated in the 3D planning and then bring them into the operating room.